magic school bus. Open, open, open. <laughs> it's stuck. What do we do now? We say hello. That sounds friendly enough. What a place! We've got a phone for help. Oh, good. Here's a phone book. <laughs> what was that? That was a tantalizing tintinabulation. Mm. No, no, don't! don't! Oh, Foghorn. One of my favorites. Such a big, deep sound. Maybe one of these books was making the sound I heard. I don't need to know how this turns out. I'm out of here. <laughs> what kind of place is this? I wonder who lives here. Lived here, Keisha. Professor Cornelia C. Contralto, eccentric and collector of sounds. Born 1807. Disappeared 1892. How do you know that, Miss Frizzle? Because after she vanished, they turned her house, this house, into the Sound Museum. This is the Sound Museum? I knew it. We missed the rehearsal. Well, where is everyone? Mm, gone for the night, Tim. Which means we have the whole place to ourselves. Oh, boy! Oh, boy. <laughs> Professor Contralto devoted her entire life to sound. Huh? What happened to her? No one knows. Well, I'll bet you anything she's a ghost wandering around this house seeking the perfect sound. Ah! Seeking the perfect sound, just like me. Well, Carlos, you'll have plenty of time to find it. We're spending the night. The night here? But our permission slips didn't say anything about haunted houses. Besides, there's no place for us. Ah! To sleep! Oh, why look. Eight student-sized beds. And a teacher-sized annex. It's almost as if someone were... Expecting us. Well, 